Oh, that's a monster. What's up everybody? I'm out here at the pond today. I am trying something totally different. Let me show you what we're doing today. So today I finally got my lures in from Timu. I've always wanted to try this and I've never used one of these lures before even a, any uh, like a name brand. So this uh, and who knows the name brand coming from Timu but this is just a big spider. Never used a spider, never caught anything off a spider, obviously. Set up pretty much like a frog. I don't know how durable this is, but we're going to throw her on so we can catch at least one fish with the Timu lure. I also have another one. I'll show you all that one when I'm out on the water. It is more shallow than I thought, but we're still going to give her a shot, so let's do it. All right, throw on the spider. Ooh, that looks pretty good. I see that. Oh, yeah. You got to remember to wait just like you do with a frog. Well, that's not good. I don't want to do that. Let's figure out why it's doing that. Well, I'm going to have to put some super glue on this thing. I don't know if that's going to help or not. I'm going to do something else for a minute. We'll pull that back up too. I'll throw my little micro swim bait. Give it a little bite. something for a second that was weird unless I was just running across a, a branch or something started reeling and my line was going sideways so I don't know Oh yeah. Finally, 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 finally decent, decent, decent. On the chatterbait. Nothing on the team move yet, but hey, that's a pretty little fish. He's a little guy. Let's see. He's about maybe 12 or 13. Let's see. Tail. Eh. He is. He's almost 14. Decent little fish. Let's get it. Later, dude. Thank you. It's coming over a bunch of brush, some twigs and stuff like that, and old chatterbait comes through. I'm gonna throw the little team new top water up in there and see if I can get lucky with that, maybe. I'll take a little almost 14-incher. 
no doubt. I was about to go to the Timu worm that I got, and I may do that. Maybe top water is not the thing right now. That was a cold fish, though. I don't know what the water temp is right here, but that fish. Oh, so I don't know how to get over that. Are you kidding me? How do I? How do we get a top water frog type lure hung on the back side of a log? I did. I just did. I'm gonna throw this again. Not get tangled up in my line. Let's see if there's another one over here somewhere. Come up. Y'all know I'm good at this. I'm good at getting two rods, two lures. <laughs> I'm gonna have a think time with it just do. Alright. Let's get over here and figure this mess out that I just created when I knew I should have done it. So it's daylight savings time. Which not a fan. If you're not a fan, give me a comment saying you're not a fan. Because I can't stand daylight savings time. It's supposed to be dark. Well, sunset. 4.45. And I know it'll get a little later here and there, but good grief. It is ridiculous. 4.45. Come on, man. No reason for it either. Absolutely no reason to do daylight savings time. And don't give me the old thing about the farmers and the cows and all that bull crap. <laughs> bull crap. Anyway. Because guess what? My dad told me a long time ago. He's like, hey, the cows got to be milked. No matter what. So, you're going to milk them when they need to be milked. It don't matter if it's dark or if it's light outside. We all got lights nowadays. Ain't nobody running candles. So... See if we can figure this out, okay? Or a snake. That's a what is that? Is that two tall? Can y'all see that? I think that's two turtles. Now that is strange. It, it's almost like one turtle is I it's like one turtle grabbed a hold of the other one. The other one's trying to swim away. And I hope y'all can see that. That is weird. One more time, see if, the, if that'll help. That is another strange thing I've never seen before. I'm gonna leave them alone just in case, you know, they're <clears throat> being intimate or something. How's it going? You have any luck? Oh yeah? Using minnows? Nice. That's a decent fish. That might be a crappie. Oh, that's a crappie. Oh, that's a good crappie. That's a good crappie. <laughs> that's a good crappie. Did not expect. I was hoping. That's a decent little crappie right there. That is not bad. Not bad at all, man. This one is not going to the tree. This one is. He is 
is right at, dang, he's almost 12. I pinched the tail. That's a 12 incher. That's, I think that's bigger. Is that bigger than the one I had the other day? Let me throw him on the stringer. Just see if we can. I was afraid to send the hook because it was just like he was barely hitting it just like this one is. It's not a bass because he would have popped it. Oh, sucker. Not be able to see this, but I'm putting this one on the belly, man. This is for you. Praying for you. Hope you do well, man. We know you're gonna pull out of this. I got a crappie on the belly, just for you. There, let's go. It's too crappie today. This is the most crappie I've ever caught, other than when I was growing up as a kid. <clears throat> I've never caught this many crappie in one year. This is a pretty one. Look at this one. He's not as big as the other one. Well, let's see how big he is. He's big enough to keep. Yeah, he's like 10. He's about 10 and a half, I think. Yep. It's over 10, 10 and a half. I might fry me up some crappie tonight. This carpal tunnel ain't no fun, y'all. <gasps> Just had a follow. Oh, I got another one. I got another one. I got a freaking another one. Oh, no. He's too little, though. He's a little guy. Little one. That's three. <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm actually catching crop. I can't believe it. I think I still got a little daylight left. Even though it's daylight savings time and that sucks. Take it. There he goes. Come on, take it. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Oh, I don't know. He might be 10. Easy, dude. Easy, easy. Oh, man. Let's see what he is. Ooh, man, that hook just came right out. Let's see if he's 10. I don't think he is. right at 10. I'm going to let him go. Not much of a fillet there. Take it, take it, take it. Oh, shoot. Is he still on? There he is. There he is. Oh, man. <laughs> He's fighting. Oh, that's a 10 either. Alright, now, 
I have now exceeded the amount of crappie that I've even caught all year this year. I caught three, he's just over 10. <laughs> this snacky swimmer, I'm telling y'all, if you want to catch some crappie and you don't have any minnows, use this dude. This thing is slaying them. I mean slaying them. Guggen, snacky swimmer. I'll get some. Got him at Bass Pro Shop, by the way. Not an endorsement, or they don't endorse me. I just worked there. So the Timu baits didn't do very well, but I don't know. I only caught the one bass, and that was on good old faithful chatterbait. And I don't know, probably morning would be better for the top water with the spider, maybe the worm. I don't know. We'll try it again. I'm gonna go out to hopefully my favorite pond soon. And I'm on, I think. Yep. Oh my gosh, they are stacked here. They are freaking stacked. It's another small one, but goodness they are everywhere out here so that's probably maybe a 10 and maybe a nine incher there he's a little smaller than the other ones they're hitting it as it's moving oh my gosh there's another he's he's running out with it <laughs> I, you, I didn't even stop the camera this time i didn't even stop that might be a keeper that might be 11 incher might be a good one to keep another one that'd be three look at that one all right let's see if he's 11 i'll keep him but if he's not i'm gonna let him go so that's right there no two and a half two and a half man ain't nothing wrong with that there's nothing wrong a bunch of 10 inch crappies at least i don't think so y'all tell me what you think Anything wrong with the 10-inch crop? I don't see how there could be. So I'm just kind of casting it up toward the bank and then just letting it drop a little bit and then I'm reeling it kind of slow. Most of the time they're hitting it while I'm reeling. Oh, no, no, no. Kind of letting it drop. I'm reeling it back, probably 10, 15 feet, and then I'm kind of letting it. So I reel it, I drop it, or I let it drop, and then hold on, I let it drop, then I reel a little bit, and then I'll let it drop again, depending on where my cast went. I don't know if crop are skittish. I have no idea. So. He ain't that big. I don't think he's a he's probably right at ten. Yeah. He smacked it like a big boy, I'm telling you. Yep, ten and a half. There's a bunch of ten and a half ones in here, I can tell you that. So you can get another decent one here. But he just destroyed it. I know that. Oh, that's a monster. 
Oh, that's a monster. If that's a crappie, that's a monster. Oh, it is. It's a monster crappie. Oh my gosh. 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 No, don't get out. Don't get out. Oh my god. I thought the one before was a monster that I had at the other place. Oh man. This might be. I forgot my scale. This is a beast. He ripped it. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> this thing is a monster. Look at this thing. Oh my god. Oh man. <laughs> oh man. This thing. This thing's almost 13. He's almost 13. I gotta get my scale. Scale. All right, I'm at zeros. Oh, he's almost a pound. Almost a pound. Mouth closed, he's 13 inches. Might be my biggest crappie other than one I caught a long time ago. But that... I don't know, is that considered a slab? A 13 inch crappie? Is that a slab crappie? I need to know. That is awesome. God, that is so awesome. It's amazing. That is freaking awesome. That dude came out of nowhere. That may have been the big dog in here. I don't know. There's, I'm, I would assume I would assume there's bigger crappie in here, but I don't know, man. I've never, I think I caught one tiny crappie out of here one time. It was a while back if I did, but there's another tap. He's on. That might be a keeper too. I don't know, he might be thousand. Might be 10, let's see if he's 10. I'm reeling these guys way too close up. I can, that's a bad habit of mine. All right, let's see. He's probably a 10. He may be 10. That was close. I don't know if he was 10 or not. All right, just a few. Oh, crap, a roll right up on my spot. Again, don't know if crop your skills. Time, I guess I should bring a, bring a cooler with me, huh? There it is, there's another tap, and he's on. That's another good one. That, that might be another keeper. He might be at least 11. This, I'm starting to learn crappie links, guys. Let's see if he's 11 or not. That's another nice one. Let's see where he at, bro. He's over 11. That's a good fish. I got four. Four on here. I got three on here. I'm gonna let him go. I get one like bigger, which I mean, that's, that's a pretty good size one right there. This thing is crushing them. I could get another big one. I'd, I'd head out. I gotta head out soon anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But three would be a pretty good little snack for me. That one is gonna be nice. So when they tap it, I'm just letting it drop. And if they don't grab it after that, as I start reeling, I don't. I'm not setting the hook either, which is hard not to do. But what I'm doing is. When they tap it, I let it, I let it just, I stop reeling. And then, 
I um, I see if they take it when I feel them tap it. And if they take it, I just reel up my line and then I just real slowly just pull back on them. All right, guys. So here's the fillets. I'm gonna get them. We'll put them in a little bit of a mixture of cornmeal and some flour. Obviously the one on this side, that's the 13 incher along with that. And then the other ones are the small fillets, so let's get after it. Looks pretty good. First batch in. I don't have the big pieces in yet. Alright, so I got the first batch done. I'll show you when I get them all out. But they are looking good. Good. Wow. That's a good fillet right there. All right, there it is. Let me get out of the way here. Man, those look good. Time to eat. Oh, there it is. Let's see what it tastes like. All right, here we go. Just gonna try a small piece first. Mm -mm -mm. Hang on a second. All right. Look at that. Man. Just. You talk about some good white meat right there. That is beautiful. So again, this is the crappie. In case you're tuning in at a different timeline or something. But. It's so good. I have not had fresh fish since I was in Florida. And this is the closest I can get, I guess, to really good fresh fish. So here. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. All right. Well, I guess I'm going to share a little bit with the family. Even though I don't really want to. Ha <laughs> ha! No. But I do. Look. Y'all get you some crappie. A lot of y'all out there are already eating crappie, I'm sure. Get some. This is probably the most I've ever caught. I'll put up a number somewhere up here as to how many I caught today. And once I go through the video and you guys will see that number. and It's probably going to be twice as many as I've caught not just all year, but since I started my channel. There was a, I caught a lot today, so y'all have a good one. I'll see you out there on the water.